Hey, what's up guys? This is Josh here, and today we're taking a look at the DC Collectibles Earth 2 Batman figure, or Thomas Wayne. <clears throat> now, before we get into review, I will not be taking a look at the box. It's basically the same as all the regular New 52 packaging, and with that out of the way, let's dive right into the detail on this figure. And, uh, it's basically another Batman figure, nothing really spectacular spectacular that sticks out uh the interesting part is who the character is now i don't follow earth <clears throat> excuse me now i don't follow earth 2 but i did hear that uh earth 2 batman is thomas wayne and which is thomas wayne is basically bruce wayne's dad and he takes some crazy drug that makes him go all crazy and whatnot so uh that's his boat is I know that's as much as I know I could be wrong I'm not saying I'm correct or nothing but I heard from other people that that's what he's like so anyways basically he has this really uh, crazy look on his face he's got the red eyes instead of like white eyes inside the cowl here he's got a he's got a squared off chin uh, he has a very light skin tone he looks he's it's like a pale kind of skin tone but he's as if you focus you can see he's gritting his teeth his white teeth and he also has like these brown lips uh as for the face i'm not too big of a fan on the face i don't really like it but it looks okay i guess uh the cape he has a nice cape it's just more in a straight pose rather than blowing in the wind or whatever but it looks really nice I like how it hangs and drapes down his back if you take a look at the back it's a flat color black and it the cape is pretty pliable it's made of that rubber material on the inside though is what I really like it's like this nice vibrant red color and uh, you can see like all the different creases and a couple wrinkles in here it's also pointed at the end of the cape uh, coming down the chest, he's got his uh, uh, bat symbol here. It's a different looking bat symbol than the regular Batman figures. It's more of a squared kind of bat symbol. And it actually looks like the Dark Knight Returns bat symbol. Uh, it's, not, it's a red color with shiny black and like it has like the outline here in red some kind of triangle design I don't know I don't know if I really like that it's got a red utility belt nothing spectacular it's just a sculpted in belt that's plain red his suit uh, gr uh, flat color gray uh, pretty plain his gloves nothing spectacular uh, black gloves with like little squared off spikes here and then his boots, he's got regular flat black boots. Uh, and he's got tread on the bottom. Very cool. Uh, for accessories, he comes with one thing, and that is a battering. Some big looking red battering. Fits nicely in his hand. Um, and you can fold it up like so. Uh, this is my second Batman figure. The first Batman figure I got broke, but even on the battering on the first figure, it this little piece, it, you can see it's held together. It's like two pieces. Uh, some of them aren't glued, and it does see, you can see it's splitting. So be careful this doesn't like split apart and you lose pieces of the battering because it's pretty tiny. Uh, but yeah, like I said, this is my second figure. Uh, on my first one this was really stuck I tried to unstuck it and as I was unstucking unsticking it it uh, it snapped on me so that was pretty disappointing but I got a new one thanks to my comic shop uh, I asked them like hey this figure broke on me can you uh, exchange it and they're like yeah no problem so no hassles really good service there uh, nothing to complain about so beware of quality control on these figures they still have the clear plastic and yeah. Overall the design of the figure, it's pretty basic, pretty plain looking. 
nothing new. Uh, okay, for uh, articulation now, he's got a ball jointed head, ball socket shoulder, uh, bicep swivel, hinged at the at the elbow. He's got a swivel read right at the top of the glove here. Uh, nothing in the wrists. No waist, no ab crunch. Uh, he's got ball jointed hips. He's got a hinged knee, and he's got a swivel read right at the top of the boot. And he's got hinged um, ankles, and that's about it. Again, like the other ones, pretty basic articulation, but not like the previous Justice League figures. But it's not crime syndicate level of articulation. Just where I like it. Uh, yeah, so for a size comparison, here let's bring in this guy as I reach over. Let's put him right there. Let's get Alan Scott in here. Put him like right here, and let's get Wonder Woman. Let's put her right there. As you can see, here they are together. He's around this wall. I don't know. He's a little bit taller than the Flash and Green Lantern, I guess, because his ears are or whatever. But he's just a little bit taller. And of course, Wonder Woman is shorter. So they all scale nicely. Uh, what do I think of the series as a whole? I like the designs of Earth 2, just because they look different enough to warrant a pickup for me, myself. Um, but if you're not like, a, if you're not a hardcore DC fan, I don't see why you have to pick these up. Nor if you're not a big fan of any of these characters, I don't see why you'd want to pick them up. But it's your decision. It's your money. Uh, if you like them, go ahead and buy them. If you don't. They're a pass. Nothing too spectacular. Now let's just put them, put these ones over here, out of the way. And for another size comparison, let's bring in his son, Bruce Wayne, the regular Batman from the Justice League series. Um, and this, the regular Batman is taller than this new. Earth 2 Batman. And yeah. So yeah. That's pretty much it. Alright. That's it you guys. Uh, that was my review of the DC Collectibles Earth 2 Batman. Again. Nothing too spectacular. He's a decent figure. Uh, the design. It's okay. Uh, I don't mind it. And uh, yeah. Alright guys, be sure to check out my other videos and uh, stay tuned because uh, probably within the next couple days, I'd say the next three days or so, I'll be uploading a collection video. So stay tuned for that and I will catch you guys later. Alright guys, take care.